What's up guys, my name is Excalion, and I have a quick fix for you if you are using the EVGA XR1 uh, light or maybe any of those products, the Pro or the RGB. Um, I have the EVGA XR1 light right here. This is a great product. Um, very pleased with it so far. Very affordable as a capture device, around 60 bucks on Amazon. Great product. I'll leave the uh, leave the uh, Amazon page for this in the description, so if you want to check it out, you can. Um, but I did run into one issue. After setting up the device um, and disabling the uh, HDCP on my PlayStation, which finally let me get the video coming through, um, I ran into an audio issue. And as you can see right now, right here, my card audio, that's what I have named, um, there's nothing. And you can see I'll move around my PlayStation right here and I'm getting absolutely, uh, y'all can see right, right there, like trying to, trying to move stuff around over and it's not doing anything okay so um i i needed a solution and i was on youtube i was on google for watching videos for probably the better part of an hour trying to figure out how to fix this issue uh because i wanted to get into more streaming and stuff like that so i couldn't come up with any solutions i uh, saw many different videos with uh basically nothing and there were so many things talking about going in and changing your settings. And uh, I finally got a solution, but it wasn't changing the settings or anything like that. It was actually quite simple. And so I'll show you real quick uh, by logging out of my PlayStation. And I'll explain all this in just a second. If I hit log out, oh, look at that. Now I have audio. You see that? It's, it's faint, there you go. Audio coming from it now. So, I noticed this whenever I was uh, rebooting my PlayStation to see if maybe that would fix the issue. And I was on this screen and I noticed, hey, there's audio. So I thought that that would fix the issue, right? Um, reboot the PlayStation, it comes up, and now suddenly it works. Uh, that is not the case, actually, uh, because I noticed that whenever I logged in, uh, suddenly uh, the sound goes away just like that. So that told me uh, two things. One, uh, it's it's not an issue with the card. <laughs> and two, uh, there's an issue with, with logging in, right? Whenever you're not logged in, the PlayStation basically just runs all the default stuff, including sound and audio. So simple solution for you. Here you go. Um, I have here uh, my Quadcast HyperX uh, mic and my headset. And this is what I use to listen to my game and play with my friends. Uh, chat in my party and so if you go down here to your dashboard or your, your crossbar here and you go to sound output device is my HyperX quadcast um, and you can also access this via your settings menu just make sure you go to sound and it shows you the exact same thing here um, but just for ease of use I use this option and Fun fact, if you go to that and you change it to HDMI device, uh, TV in parentheses, suddenly there you go. So basically, it's real simple. It's sending sound to whatever source you have, you know, mained or hooked up. And that for me is the headset. Now, um, this is separate from your um, from your input device, which is here, which is mic. And as you can see, I still have my quadcast set up as the mic. Um, I can still talk to my friends and all of that, no problem. Once I got this issue resolved, I, I realized, you know, I can still talk to them via that mic. I just couldn't get the output there. So it's real simple. It's not a big deal. Um, the only thing you need to do is, and you can do this by either taking this headset or whatever. I have another headset, I have an Astro A10 here. I just have it hooked up directly to my PC. And um, go to your settings right here on your capture device. And what you're going to do is you're going to go to output. And uh, no, it's not output, it's audio. Audio, right here. Uh, under advanced, there's a monitoring device and you're gonna wanna make sure after you get your headset plugged up, that you're uh, hooked up instead of default to speakers. Real, real tech, high definition audio, whatever is, is for your PC. Um, just make sure it's set up to your speakers. And then apply and hit OK. And now you can hear everything from your PlayStation via the headset connected to your PC. And that's including your chat audio, your friends, your party audio, uh, game audio, all of that. Um, you can still talk to them via your other mic which uh, I have, you know, right right here. So I can still talk to them via that. And yeah, uh, probably
problem solved. Uh, now, again, I'm, I'm doing all this on PlayStation 5. Um, I, I would assume that this issue is also the same for Xbox. I know it, it's also the same way for PS4, so I would assume Xbox One and Xbox Series is. Um, I would, I would assume that this is the same thing. So if you're running into this issue, I hope that this fixes it for you. Uh, really, that's it. Uh, subscribe, check out the channel. We're kind of coming up on subscriber count a little bit. I play Destiny, you know, maybe not the most fun game in the world, but I love it. It's, it's my passion project. So uh, I also build things with wood and I drink a lot of whiskey. That's me. Thanks for checking out the video, guys.